a couple things. First of all, it's actually really good weather outside and that always puts me in the best mood. So it's like sunny and it's February and I live in Ontario, Canada. So that's not a common sight for us. Second thing, the reason why I sound like a 12 year old boy is because I am still sick. So had a fever. Um, it sucked. <laughs> I'm just so excited to film this video. So right now I'm getting my sick butt out of bed and I am filming today. Rewind about... A couple months ago, I bought my prom dress. I bought it from a local bridal shop in my area and it was, <laughs> it was very expensive. I did not think I was going to spend that much money on it, but I really did like the dress. So I was like, you know what, mine as well. If I'm going to spend money on one dress, it should be my high school prom dress because you only go to prom once. So I was like, you know what, just dare I say YOLO. I know the kids don't say that anymore, but I just, it seems fitting for the situation. You know what, whatever. So I just bought it and I really honestly love it. But then um, David's bridal reached out to me and I was like, Shoot <laughs> and they were like we would love to work with you on a video and send you some prom dresses And I was like Yes, thank you so much to David's bridal for sponsoring this video I am so excited to work with you guys even my friends when I told them that I was getting sponsored by them They were like are you kidding like they're amazing then I was like okay like they're online So they can't be that like amazing compared to a really expensive one that I bought They can't be comparable and blah 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 because the ones that I picked are a lot cheaper Needless to say I tried them on and I was wrong I decided to make this video because I know that there's a lot of you guys who want to prom dress shop online. It's kind of scary because you don't know what the color or size is going to be. You don't know when it's going to get here. How risky it is shopping online for a dress that costs a lot of money and that you want to fit and you want to love and you're going to take so many pictures in it and there's going to be so many memories that come from you wearing the dress. It's a lot of pressure shopping online. Like I understand the pressure and I wanted to kind of relieve that stress off of you guys and kind of do the online shopping through this sponsorship and try some dresses and see what it's like shopping online. I can't say that this is going to speak for every single bridal shop online, but I can speak for David's bridal. There were so many dresses in my cart that I wanted. So the selection, not even a problem. They have every single type of dress that you want. And if you guys want to shop any of the products that I'm showing you guys from David's bridal, so the two dresses and any of the accessories that I'm going to be showing, you guys can click the links down below and it'll take you directly to it. I know that a lot of you guys are going to prom this year. So just click those links and shop David's bridal. I so recommend. So the dress that I actually bought from the the local shop. I actually do love it. I'm not even going to say that I don't like it because I feel like if I didn't find David's bridal, I would just be perfectly fine just wearing that and not even worrying about it. It is a satin ruby red dress. It has an A-line silhouette. It doesn't puff out too much at the bottom, which I didn't really want. I kind of wanted it straight, but just a little bit of Kremlin underneath. So the satin makes it a little bit more unique. And the top of it is super flattering because it's really structured and it goes in at the smallest part of me, which is my waist. My favorite part is probably the back because it has these cute little straps and that design at the back is so pretty. I think this dress is beautiful. I'm not even going to lie and I love it. But this was the one that was about four times more expensive than the ones that I bought. So let's go to the David's bridal ones and see how they compare. The first dress that I tried on was this blue kind of like A-line dress and it's very similar to my red one. The material was a bit different but honestly you're going to get a bit of a different material if it's like $400 less money. I do really like the color but the color did not look the best for my skin tone in my opinion. I feel like it would look good on darker skin tones. The back was so pretty. Like the lace back. I honestly really like that. I feel like it's something pretty unique because a lot of people have like the lace up back instead of like the actual lace. And it has like cute little slit on the side and it was really cool because it went all the way up and you'd probably have to wear shorts or something underneath because you don't want to like woo, like flash everyone. Sizing was true to size. I had to actually pin the straps so ignore the safety pins that you see in these because I had to pin the straps because I am very short. I just didn't really fit that well. You can just get that altered. All of these I have to get altered. So my red one I have to get shortened and a couple things altered. So all of these are not perfect. But I'm just going to try them on and show you guys how they fit without any alterations. I'll put the price on the screen but link down below if you want to get this one. And a lot of my friends, I showed a picture to them and they loved it. So it's honestly, can I stop getting fluffs in my shop? 
So honestly, I think it is worth getting and it's definitely comparable to the one that I didn't buy online. The next one is my favorite that I got from David's Bridal. When I tried this on, my mom and I literally didn't have words. The first thing that we noticed was the like iridescent color that it has. At first you think, oh, it's like an emerald green color and it's super shiny. When it hits the light at the different angle, it has like a purple iridescence to it. So it's like green slash purple. It's the most unique thing I've ever seen in my life. Just that is amazing. Also, we got a different silhouette and it was more of a straight silhouette, which is different from the one that I actually bought. Did not think I would like it this much. Did not think it would flatter my body as much as it does. It really cinches in the waist and the good thing that I would recommend for online shopping is getting one with a lace up back because you can basically tighten it as much as you want in different areas. So like your ribs and then your bust and then your waist. Also the back on this was so so beautiful and when you turn to the side it had those little cutouts it was so interesting and I just love the back because a lot of them have the back that the red one has so it's not really that unique in that way but compared to this one I thought it was really different all in all very very comparable to the red one quality wise size is true to size I got a three in that one too I also bought some accessories from David's bridal the shoes that I got do you see that? Like, do you actually see this? Like, I don't know. Oh, there's hairs on them because I freaking am gross. I'm also playing this game today where I find out how much snot can come out of a human body in 24 hours. These are the shoes. They are so hairy. Like, what did I do? These are the most beautiful shoes I think I've ever seen in my 17 years of living. They're completely rhinestoned and I don't know if you guys can tell what they are. They're silver rhinestones, like regular rhinestones, but they have a rose gold tint. I don't know if you can tell from the lighting, but sometimes it catches the light and they look sort of pink. Also, the toe has little sparkles on it and it's gold. It's the perfect height, so if you have a date that's not too tall, then you're still not going to be taller than him, I don't think. It just depends how tall he is. And I can probably wear these again as well. And I also got a little clutch purse because you don't want to be carrying around an ugly like backpack <laughs> imagine like carrying a backpack around anyways and it went with my shoe choice and it's just like kind of really simple but you can honestly fit so much in here and the clasp I was confused but it really is just opens like that there's also a strap that you can put around your body and it's just really simple and clean and I love it I also got some like actual jewelry accessory things so the first one is this little pearl bracelet and I feel like this would go really well with the blue dress that I got because there's not many diamonds on that but I feel like pearls would go well with it and then I also got this bracelet which is so cute and it's like gold is that rose gold I don't even know Gold. Okay, either gold or rose gold with diamond encrusted in it. I can wear this with any dress and I'm going to keep this and wear this after prom because it's so freaking pretty. Even if you guys don't want to buy a dress off of David's Bridal, I just suggest getting accessories because they have so many things to choose from and they also have hair accessories. I also got these hair clips because I don't know if I want to have my hair up or down, but I feel like I could use these in any way. There was a fluff floating. So it comes with these like some diamond ones and some pearl ones. Yeah, so those are all the accessories that I got. I also wanted to mention that the shipping for David's Bridal is really good. So if you are worried that you're not going to get your prom dress in time, do not even fret. It's going to come in time. They have so much selection. They're true to size. Honestly, I don't really know what they're missing. Like, let me know, because I don't know. So if you guys want to shop any of the accessories or the dresses that I got, then just click the links down below and it'll take you right to them. I am so surprised. Like, I never thought that you could actually buy a nice prom dress that will fit you and that's good quality online for not over $800 million. But apparently that's it's possible. So I hope this was kind of like eye-opening for you guys. I love trying on these prom dresses. I still don't know which one I'm going to wear to prom because it is honestly, I think it's between the emerald green one and my red one. Let me know down below which one is your favorite because I want your guys' opinion on this. Thank you so much to David's Bridal for sponsoring this video and I will also be doing more prom themed videos like get ready with me for prom and I'm trying to get permission to get the promposals from my school and maybe post them so I'm trying to get a lot of prom content so let me know down below what prom videos you want me to make because I only go to prom once unless I fail school this year then I'll probably go back to school and then go to prom again but we're not hoping for that thank you guys so much for watching I love you so much and I will see you in my next video bye